Hello, this is Victor from RestoreYourMercedes.com. This video is for Tomislav in Croatia. Uh, Tomislav, I have your units connected here. I went again connected the pigtail to the throttle body, and I also connected the, this e gas module to my bench, um, you know, to the power supply, basically a couple of wires, and to the throttle body here so what we're gonna do now is we're gonna go over so basically soldered over here right directly to the board through the pigtail here at the uh, connector it goes all around through all these wires right directly to your e-gas module so this is your e-gas module right here uh, power go over here it goes in here and here and here it goes through here through there up into the power supply this is my e-gas module the one I tested your unit with you remember first video I sent you so it's unsoldered right at the moment so I can connect yours and check it out this is some non ASR unit but that's nothing to do with this test right here so basically put the power on this duplicates and when the engine is on but I mean when the uh, car is on but engine is not running okay so this is an older style control module with this control module throttle plate does not open all the way when the engine is not running as you can see it opens only this much that is a normal behavior it happens to all of them and uh, uh, earlier styles like 95s for example and 96s e class c class uh, those are um, those open all the way but 94 93 92 they don't they just uh, when the engine is not running it will not let the throttle to open all the way so as you can see the lever here if I move it throttle itself is not responding which is good that's the way it's supposed to be but other than that it does work so as you can see as shown on my previous video for you it works so with my e-gas module and now it works with your e-gas module I cannot test it with uh, the vehicle at the moment I don't have any vehicles that I can plug it into but uh, it seems like the control module is working okay so I don't really see a problem here because if module would have been bad for the throttle it would not work it would usually just shut down so um, you said that the throttle was completely non-operational that was completely off now now you see this thing actually works so you might have issues with some power going to the control module um, but not the throttle body or module itself they seem to be okay you can sit here all day like this move it up and down and it will work just fine so again all connected here it's kind of a mess here I'm sorry but lots of work and I had no time to clean all this stuff so it does work fine it holds the idle the right location of the throttle plate I can uh, Shut it down. You can shut it down. Shuts down. Activates. Deactivate. So so you can see it does work. Um, next thing what I'm going to do is I'm going to be working on another throttle body right now. So I'm going to leave these things energized as they are just to see if there is something to do with temperature when unit the throttle body I know is fine but uh, the e-gas module I'll leave it on energized with your unit connected for quite a few hours while I'm working on the other unit and see if it shuts down when it gets hot uh, I never seen that happen but who knows We'll just double test, double check it because it came a long way from 
Europe so um, you know you want to make sure okay so this is the second video I have here for you and uh, I'll uh, contact you and we'll see what we're gonna do all right I'll keep you posted uh, Victor at restorymercedes.com thanks for watching